All right, what's up everyone? So right now I'm in a band hospital on this island. It's pretty remarkable. I took a look around really quick and it's absolutely insane. What's this in the vial? This hospital was part of a coal mining island which was built in the early 1960s and closed down in 2001 due to several mining accidents on the island. The reason why everything is so well preserved inside the hospital is because most people were forced to leave due to dangerous levels of pollution from the mining accidents. Man, this is brand new. I've never seen this before. Looks like some sort of gain. A sealed box container. Oh, what could it have been? Oh, it looks like stamps. I'm just noticing small things here and there because I'm just trying to find new things. I already found a lot. Look at these slippers. Check this out. All the surgical tools for the dentist. The great thing about Japan is just these abandoned places are just so well preserved. In America, there'd be nothing left behind. It'd just be empty rooms. This is why I just love traveling abroad and exploring these abandoned places because, in my opinion, they're my favorite outside of America. This room has a lot, but there's one thing I cannot find, and it was literally a picture of Picasso right here. Now it's gone. This room has so many things like the medicines, chemical equipment. I don't know what sort of things they would do to it, but this would spin the things around, heat it up, do some chemical reactions on it. Crazy. I honestly think I found it. It's just laid here in a different spot. But wait till you guys check this out. Picasso painting. Signature's right there. On this abandoned island. This thing could be worth a fortune, who knows? Unbelievable that's just up here. I'm not joking, there's dust all over it. This isn't something that I just took and put here. This thing is legit, a Picasso painting inside this hospital on a deserted island. This could have been like a doctor's favorite painting. And this is probably the most amazing find I've ever found inside an abandoned building. Yo, I missed out on this room before. Can we find something cool? shoes now this thing is literally hiding in this room I wonder what could be inside looks like a storage area and you got more tools right here I don't want to find out what's in that bag I really don't wow I keep finding new things oh this is for the heartbeat Heading to the second floor. So far, I'm enjoying it. You see, when there's new things to find, it's so much better. It actually, feels like it's my first time here. So this floor is where they kept all the patients. Um, there's a lot of rooms here. I'm just gonna go one by one, show you guys how they look like. I'm not gonna explore all of it. Just the ones I find interesting, I'll probably film. I found Joshi. Welcome everybody. Welcome. Josh, what do you think about this place? I think it's the best preserved hospital I've ever stepped foot in that's abandoned. Better than Chernobyl. 
exactly what I said. By far the most unique patient room in this floor comes with this right here. That can't be blood. But I mean, maybe it can't evaporate because it's just sealed tight in that jar. That's funny. Just wrote his name on the chalkboard. I have something similar where I wrote my name here on the chalkboard, but I think it's down on the first floor, and this was like seven months ago. Into this room already. Again, guys, go see my old video. I'm just doing new rooms that I haven't been to right now. Oh, here's my name. I saw that you wrote yours over there. I like this chalkboard. 2016 Expo with Steve. That's dude, it's 17 though. Dude, I was here in 2016. Oh. Good chance. Second time here. And probably who knows how long I'll come here again. So we're just gonna stamp our name to eternity. What do you think of this place, Steve. man? I love this place. You love it? It's so well preserved. Yeah. Just look at this though. This room and that room are my two favorite rooms. Yeah, for sure. For sure, for sure. Crap, guys. Look over here. What could be in this room? Oh my god. We hit the jackpot, guys. This is. Unbelievable. <laughs> this is great. John's telling me that there's a basement floor. Oh shit. What? Dude, that's the right now. So we'll go down. The way out. There's jars left here. Box rotting. Whoa, look at all these scriptures. Dude, so many documents and scripts and books. John, what do you think of this place, man? I think this place is sick. I think it's better than any other hospital I did in America. I think we're all saying that right now. Just about done, but oh my god. Another room that I missed out on. Check out the teapot. And this time you got a hippo one. I think these are nail clippers. What kind of com computer is this? Look at the keyboard. It looks like they had a touchscreen one. No, it can't be. That's crazy though. And the old printer. Who picked your time? Okay, that's the last, 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 All right, guys, ending the video right here. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you like it, please give a thumbs up, subscribe, and share. Also, leave a comment down below. Tell me what you guys think about this place. We're heading out to the next van building. Packing up. Getting a sniper rifle ready. <laughs> Be sure to also check out Explorer John, Explorer Cody, Explorer Josh, and of course, Espinaz, our boy. Check him out on Instagram. Also, be sure to check out my other videos. It's going to be linked down below yet again. Thank you, and thanks for watching.
What's up guys? Don't forget to check out my second channel, Steve Roden, and be sure to follow me on all my social media accounts. Also, if you enjoy my videos and wish to support me on my adventures, feel free to check out my Patreon account where I will personally send you a postcard. Thank you and thanks for watching.